Welcome! In front of me is a Motorola Moto E14, and today I'll show you how you can enable and set up your portable hotspot. So to get started, pull down your notifications by swiping down from the top of your screen, and then swipe down again to extend the list of visible toggles. Next, you're looking for the portable hotspot, so if it's not visible on the first page, you can swipe to the left and this will show you additional pages. Let's see if I can find mine. Am I seeing this correctly? I have two different Wi-Fi's. Interesting. Anyway, um... Oh, there it is. So, uh, you can see that right now it is grayed out for me. This is because um, some devices have this stupid thing enabled called uh, Data Saver. And even stupider enough is when you try to open it up, it just won't allow you to. It just tells you Data Saver is on. Instead of taking you to the settings so you can turn that damn thing off, uh, you kind of can't. You can't even navigate into the settings. So we're going to do that manually. Uh, if for you this isn't grayed out and it looks like these toggles right here, you can hold it and this will take you to the settings. Uh, if you have the data saver on, uh, let's navigate to the settings and then network and internet, data saver, and you want to turn it off. Once you do so, you can see that now it becomes uh, actually toggleable. So we're going to hold it. Like I mentioned before, this quickly takes us to the settings. Now, the reason you want to navigate in here is because under the hotspot password, you will find a randomly generated password. Now, for you, it will look different than it does for me. And now, you could use it, but let's be honest, it's absolute abhorrent garbage, so I recommend removing it and setting up your only password, which will need to have at least eight characters in length. That can be letters or numbers, it doesn't really matter. From there, click on OK to save the changes. You can go over other options in here uh, if you want to. I will keep them by default uh, as they are, as this will ensure that the hotspot will function with the widest array of devices. From there, once everything is set, find the toggle, and you can now tap on it to toggle it on. Now, one thing to also pay attention to, you've seen we had Wi-Fi enabled. For some reason, I have two different Wi-Fi signals right here visible, but okay. Um, so, it just be Wi-Fi is actually off right now when hotspot is enabled. So again, it's you can see that it is not enabled. I'm not going to do anything. I'm just going to turn off right now hotspot because let's just assume we're done using it. And Wi-Fi just turned on. It's still looking for connection. There we go. It's connected to network. And again, if I were to turn on hotspot, it's going to automatically turn it off. It's using the same antennas for Wi-Fi as it does for uh, for hotspot, so therefore it can only do one of those things at a time and uh, it's just going to disable the other one. Now anyway, with that being said, hopefully you found this video helpful and if you did, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.